3M Interam E 5A 4 Mat. One hour electrical circuit protection around a cable tray. Refer to Intertech's Omega Point Lab System ECP 523 and 3M installation guidelines for complete system details. Measure the circumference around the cable tray. Transfer the measurement to the E mat, allowing additional material to maintain a minimum 2 inch perimeter overlap. Cut the E mat to length. Install the first piece of mat onto the cable tray and tape the leading edge of the cable tray with 3 quarter inch wide filament tape. Wrap the free end of the mat around the tray and secure with filament tape. Install the remaining first layer pieces of e-mat onto the tray as previously demonstrated. Be sure each adjacent sections of mat are tightly butted to each other. Install T49 aluminum foil tape at all perimeter and adjacent seams. Use a roller to ensure the tape is adhered to the E-mat. Measure and cut the second and third layers of mat, making sure you maintain a minimum 2 inch overlap on the circumferential seams and a minimum 2 inch offset on the longitudinal seams. Stagger the second layer of mat, maintaining a 2 inch offset from the first layer seam and maintaining a minimum 2 inch circumferential overlap. Install the second and third layer pieces of E mat onto the tray as previously demonstrated. Be sure each adjacent sections of mat are tightly butted to each other. Install T49 aluminum foil tape at all perimeter and adjacent seams on the second and third layers. Use a roller to ensure the tape is adhered to the E-mat. Measure where the bands are to be placed. Cut the band to length. Install the wing clip on the band. Install the bands around the final layer of E-mat. One band is required on each side of a butt seam of the adjacent pieces. The center line of bands must be within one inch from the butt seam. Bands must also be placed between the butted seams at 12 inch on center spacings throughout the system. Using a tensioner, tighten each band so they do not move freely and do not cut into the aluminum foil. Cut the band with the tensioner and crimp the wing seal.